Hi, I'm Christy with T's Kitchen. And in this summer series episode, I'm gonna be showing you how to make Cajun rice dressing. Let's roll that intro. I'm gonna get started cutting up my veggies. So for this, you need one onion, half of a bell pepper and some celery. So this is optional. If you are sensitive to peppers, you can leave this out or you can cut back on this. Um, I'm using one whole jalapeno. So now we're gonna get our meat browning. I have my um, fire set at a medium heat and I'm just gonna coat the bottom of my pot lightly with a little bit of oil. Um, I'm using half and half. Um, a pound of ground beef and then a pound of ground pork. So we're gonna get that browning. Okay, so our meat has been browning for a little while. I'm gonna go ahead and add in my veggies. Um, and then I'm also gonna add in two cloves of freshly minced garlic. So I'm just gonna stir this up and I'm gonna cook this until my veggies start to get soft. Okay, so our veggies have been cooking in our ground meat mixture and they're just nice and soft. You wanna get your onions to the point where they're just kind of translucent. And then we're gonna slowly add in, hear me out, we're gonna add in some root and we're gonna slowly add in stock. I'm just gonna add a little bit at a time. We're probably gonna end up adding about three cups of beef stock. And I'm just gonna stir that up. And then I'm gonna add my seasoning. I'm using Cajun seasoning, and you can just use however much seasoning you like. And then I'm gonna add some garlic powder. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of cayenne. And then I'm just gonna stir that up. Throughout the cooking process, once this roux kind of dissolves, um, I'm gonna, I just check on it, I stir it, I taste it. So for now, you're just gonna put your fire on like a medium low heat and we're just gonna let that simmer. Okay, let's check on our rice dressing stock. It smells so good. I wish you could smell this. It's gonna give it a, we're gonna give it a quick stir. And then I like to add right at the end, some chopped green onions. I'm gonna give that a mix. And then there's only one thing left to do. I'm gonna go get some rice. Okay, so I have my cooked rice. And so this is our final step to the rice dressing. You're gonna add your cooked rice to this mixture. One thing to keep in mind also is that after you mix your rice into your rice dressing stock, you're gonna let it sit here for a few minutes and it's gonna still soak up some of that rice dressing stock. So you probably wanna err on the side of a little less rice if that's how you like it. And there you have it, our rice dressing. I hope you enjoyed this and I hope that your family loves this recipe just as much as my family does. Thank you for joining us.